Hi there and happy Saturday. Back today to do the Amazon packaging uh, journal. I started this on Roxy's uh, weekly challenge. So that's Rachel at Roxy Creations. Have made a playlist which will include uh, that challenge and the decorating of the cover and what we've done uh, so far. So if you're new, I'm Tanya and I'm from Tatty Treasures. Welcome and welcome aboard if you've subscribed. If you haven't subscribed and you like what you see today, please uh, do con consider subscribing. And hello and welcome back to my um, already subscribed people. I don't know what the word is. My, um, yeah. Hi, <laughs> welcome back. Thanks for joining me again. Hope you're enjoying this uh, so far. I think we've... When you think, oh, I've only done blah and blah and blah, but then when you break it down, I do think we've got <coughs> quite far with it. Probably going to do um, another three, so including this one, so another two after this. And then I'm going to break for a few weeks to um, do another um, guest design team for Tina at Shabby Dabby Doo And then once that's done, I shall come, come back to this, because I'm in no rush to get it finished. To be honest, I, I do want to just do step by step and take my time um, because I think it's going to be absolutely fabulous. So any kits and things that I've used will be down below in the description. All my favourite supplies are in my Amazon favourites. Um, links to where to find me or how to support the channel are also done in the description. I think, I think I've covered everything. So today we are going to decorate the um, giant uh, journal card. I've not sewed around it. I ummed and ahmed this morning, should I? And then I thought, no, I'll collage it and then I will sew around it. And we're going to do the two tags what are in here, aren't we? Yes, so we've got this one and we've got this one. Right, so I can move everything else out of out of the way so i'll pop that down there i did have a look what the tea stain um seam binding looked like and yeah this gray one is is looking the best so i'll probably think about getting it cut cut down um now we've decided i just didn't want to cut it down and then you know end up with uh two pieces so i think because it's First, first video of the day. It's my first really task of the day. I have just zoomed around the house, <laughs> zoomed, um, and had a bit of a tidy up. But <clears throat> I still am on wake up mode, really. So let me show you what. Let me see what I was going to say actually. <laughs> so we'll start off with the small ones, and then we'll do the big one. Woof. Um, yeah. Obviously, my my mouth's not tired, is it? Because I, I can rub it. <laughs> rabbit 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 let me tell you what i've got so i've just got some postage stamps i've pulled out the the neutral ones um i actually think i've mixed them all together now because i did i ended up i've not got that many left so actually all the color ones are in here and all the um nature type ones are, are in another folder like this uh pouch then i've got my uh big birds big birds and little birds um and they're just fussy cut i think they're mainly out of books i think there's a few from um bird digitals and to collage i have got let's have a look well i've got some music paper i've got that scrapbook paper and it's from uh die cuts with a view i've got some dictionary paper i've got some digital graph paper that's from tracy fox i've got um a bit of a leisure ledger not leisure ledger um from i don't know who um could be the old design shop i've got a couple of sheets from uh the bird kit that i've been using to do the booklet inside and i've pulled out one of the blue um ones from I'm not sure if because I'm going to be using two kits from Nanine for the inside, which is uh, the French one. 
and the blue botanical one so it's out of one of them and i did think i best start introducing some blue because apart from um the cover um there's not a lot of blue so far inside i've got my lovely uh bag what the lovely siobhan sent me i don't think i'm ever going to cut it up to be honest um i like it to keep um i've started keeping bits of vellum in there and doilies and tissue paper and tea bags because i think that's just what you would find in in this kind of bag <laughs> if you ever found one laying about that that's what would be in there so that's that so i think first let's pick some some birds because uh, these tags are quite small so i'm going to get them all out i forgot the tray because then once i've emptied them out i can just move it move it along without um without putting them all all away is that going to shine no it's not too bad if i just keep it well i'll keep it there for a minute okay <laughs> without further ado let's um look at these birds so we'll get these out too big oh, I could do with some little tweezers that's the right size oh, yeah might not have, have much of a choice actually <laughs> somebody might have to have the tail cut off uh, to be quite frank Hmm, that's a shame about that. I don't think I could cut his tail off enough for it to look. That's going to be too big. Too big. Oh, this could be a... Yes, that's a contender. This is from a digital, from uh, Lorna at Tailor Made Journals. So that could, I do like that. Um, I love robins, but um, yeah, because I mean, we do get robins all the time, but in the UK, they are because they're like what people put on Christmas cards and things. I don't know, I just class them with Christmas, even though you know, I see them in my garden. I don't think, oh, it's Christmas because there's a bird in the garden, but when I use them, um, in collage and things, I just think, oh, it's too Christmassy. <laughs> so, yeah. Nope. Right, so I'm going to put the robin away. I don't know what kind of bird that is. I'm not, I'm not keen on that. <clears throat> That's too big. Just have a sip of, a sip of my tea while we... Yeah, some of the medium ones did obviously go in here as well because it was a bit... I love that sticker. Um, it was a bit like, well, where do you draw the line from small to, to big? Because I didn't have a, a medium. Oh, some little chicks. Another robin. Stick it. Yeah, I think it's looking like it's it's going to be those two, which <laughs> that's fine. I've got quite a few little stickers. I have to remember that if I want to if I want to use a sticker. <laughs> I shall remember my favourite bird, a goldfinch, closely followed obviously by by the tits. I, I, I'm going to say all oh, the tits are very very pretty birds. Right, so we're going to go for these, which is good, because they're pretty similar. I think once this one's been, because this is printed on cream paper, obviously this is on uh, white paper. So I think first, <coughs> I've inked around the tags, haven't I? Yeah. So my that leaves going. So I'm just going to dub, 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 not rub in, just dub in, just to give it some some colour that's better and I don't know if I can get around any of the edges I don't 
to be careful when I'm sticking that leaf uh, down. I think I was off saying these are from Tailor Made Journals and they're in, is it a JPEG where you can decide if you want one to a page, two to a page and so forth. Um, so I think I did eight or nine to a page and, and it made them that size. I've printed them out in all different, um, well, from four, four up. Right, so yeah, I do like that one on that. I think the only, it's just gonna want a hair off off it which I'll do once it's stuck down and this one's going to want some off it so what I'm going to do is I'm going to snip those leaves off not with those ginormous scissors I'm not <coughs> and I might be able to see if I can put them um, towards the front or underneath if I remember and I don't, <laughs> don't lose them so I'll just put those up there let's just get that little that's it so I'll save those up there still, still a little bit of a tight fit I'm thinking I might take that off and then just reposition the leaves instead of just cutting it off I can probably um we'll see we'll see <laughs> we'll see what happens right um so I'm gonna want some music paper I've got two two off cut strips which way does it go that way yeah why does the back to, back of it look upside down it doesn't matter does it doesn't matter what it looks like at the back. <laughs> Not using the back. Right. Oh, I love tearing this. It's such soft um, paper. So I am going to just collage over and then I will cut round uh, the tag once I've finished because uh, I do like the collage to go right to the right to the top. Um, I just I just like it like that. I don't know if to just do opposite because there's not going to be a lot I can do do on here. This this is not the space, so let's put those up there. I think I'm fine with that. Um, let's see what it all look like if I bring some colour into into these. So yeah, that will look lovely. So I'm going to get the, the tear roller. I don't think I've used this for, for a while. Sometimes I seem to be using it all the time. I don't know if you can air it raining, but it's absolutely throwing it down it's about it's probably not even half past nine in the morning and it's as you know dark um and just throw it throwing it down so i don't know if to go for the plane or oh i like this so let's rip some of this down hope i'm okay in shot i'll just I'll just go up a little bit because it reminds me then to to bring my work forward if I've got the mat forward from me. Yeah, I like that. So let's just rip that off of the at the bottom. So that's that. Let's go in a bit more. Yeah, I'm fine with that because I want to leave so much of the of the background uh, behind it. Then 
what does this look like? Let's have a look what it looks like on the plane. I think I prefer that on the plane. I don't know, it's, just, it's more interesting obviously isn't it, the, the other one. Right, I'm going to have to tear another strip. I've torn it on the other side as well because obviously where I tore it for that one you've got this massive um, tear, you know, into the paper. So that can go about there, and that can go about there. Okay. I keep using that nail to um, <laughs> score things. Yes, my new scoring tool is my thumbnail, but. Um, yeah, it, it works and it saves picking uh, something else So I think that's the wrong way around. I'm going to do that one on, on that side because it's a lot better than, than the other side. Right, so that's, that's those. So let's um, start getting them inked up. Oh, I've got my ink out already. So I'm going to do the blue first using the gathered twigs um, I'm not sure what you'll see and what you won't see so I'll just do, do all of it so that one's coming about halfway doesn't it some music it's gonna go go on top so what I'm going to do is <coughs> I'm just going to go halfway. Come on, art glitter. You know you can do it. fine I am going to just take this side off because um, it helps me when I'm laying the second piece down otherwise I can't see where where it's ended Oof. right that's that bit I won't get this inked up so we'll have that <coughs> about there so we'll go from there I don't think my eyes are properly working yet. 
I don't know if I've got my right glasses then, actually. No, I haven't. <coughs> That's probably why, then. <coughs> it's probably why I can't see. Because I've got my prescription ones on before, from before the last one. <coughs> around this edge and top again like so and we're gonna yep, pop this one down here I'm gonna go a bit low because I also want to put put an eyelet oh just breaking it oh dear right Actually, that helps a little bit because I can possibly Yeah, I can possibly do that. So <clears throat> let me get this down first The bird must have been looking down, yeah. Yeah, and then I'm gonna go like that. <laughs> then that keeps keeps it all in. I've not got to cut cut any of the fur tree off. Yep. So that's that's that one. That's really pretty. And then this one <clears throat> I won't be sewing round these uh two smaller ones. So again I'm gonna go we're going that side, aren't we? I'm gonna go halfway. Oh, should have gone the opposite side because that is the, the side that had got the most um, the most detail in the paper. But I'm sure I'll have forgot about that in about five minutes. <laughs> it won't matter. It won't matter. I'd obviously forgot about it <laughs> beforehand. So I can remember mentioning it, it last time. But yeah, obviously wasn't that important. Right, let's just take this edge down. Okay. And yeah, I'm going to put all of all of that strip and and just cut off the the top and the the bottom so i think i'm gonna just um i might put one of the oh dear craft um stop saying mm. <laughs> i was gonna say again um whole protector i will probably put the craft ones on instead of a metal eyelet i think uh the craft one will be better and then i will put string on it uh jute jute string do you like that word jute <laughs> It's just, it's like a smiley word, isn't it? <laughs> well, I don't know if it is for everybody, but <laughs> it makes me smile. Jute. <laughs> so, 
That's lovely. Right, I'm going to put this bird as far over as I can go and then we'll see if we can get any of these leaves in. But I probably won't be able to. But the thought was there, wasn't it? I did, did think it. To think about saving saving leaves right let's get that as far over as it will go it's in the right position yes yeah, that's lovely so let's see if we can yeah we can add some I can add that leaf there like so I do that one oh I don't this one I think that one go, goes better there well I think I need another sip of my tea and so it's only my second second cup this morning. I'm not on the coffee yet. I do um <laughs> have to have two cups of tea before I can have a cup of coffee. Because um, for me, having coffee straight away is is waking up too quick. It's like I can't cope with <laughs> with that. Um, yes, I'm awake. I need to wake up slowly. So yeah, I start off with the tea and then go on, on to the hard stuff. Um, it's normally, by the time I'm on to the coffee, it's normally, you know, 11 o'clock and you, and you kind of just need that, that bit of a, so it, it does work out pretty well. So that's those two. I might as well put the holes in now because um, obviously the big one's not, not having holes in because it's a journal card. It's not a tag. So, I think that looks about middle. Like so. Let me just um, get the... Oh, I forgot about the cord again. Reinforcers. I'm going to use the hexagon ones. I really like the hexagon ones. So I'll just pop a bit of glue around that and I've got some string that Julie sent me. It's that one. Wish I'd have got that straight really. <laughs> yeah, it was a bit like wonky and and I thought like, am I leaving it wonky? <laughs> But no, I want it straight. <laughs> That's that. Right. Let's uh, do this one. Yeah, I was like, am I okay with it being one cake? No. <laughs> no, I'm not. Right. I'm going to swap my glasses over because it, I can feel I'm straining um, to see. So let me just take these up and put the other ones on. That's the only thing with keeping my old glasses, but the reason why I keep, I always keep the prescription before, um, because I, I buy two pairs when when I get my eyes tested, and I have one in my handbag for work, and I have one at the computer. But I also like a pair in the kitchen and a pair in the bedroom because I don't wear them all the time. They are supposed to just be for, you know, reading, watching telly um, and so forth. So, yes, I do walk around with them on my head a lot, but not all the time. So I can be in a room and I've got no glasses. Um, and in the kitchen, every time I cook, I need glasses. Um, and then in the bedroom, obviously I'm either fussy cutting or watching YouTube or telly, uh, so I need a pair in there as well. But then what happens is, the pair in my bedroom at night when I've watched YouTube and that, and then I put them on my windowsill, when I wake up in the morning, because I'm a slow, 
you know, from from bed to downstairs, I often get out of bed, sit on my chair. Um, why why I initially wake up and I put my glasses back on, and then obviously I forget to take them off, go downstairs, come back in here start doing something and it takes me a while to realize i've still got those glasses on anyway i'm just gonna have a sip of my tea now oh that's lovely that's our best, best drink it before it goes goes cold i think i'm gonna have to do a lot of collaging on uh, this one because um, it's going to take a big bird, isn't it, to, to fill, fill that. So I'm just going to pop these back so I can empty the, the big ones out. I hope it's not shining there, is it? No. Right, that's those. Have a look at these. Okay. Mm. I mean, space-wise, that's fabulous. I can obviously ink this all. So, yes. Here's a contain container. <laughs> it's not a container. It's a contender. <laughs> it's a container. I love that, colour-wise. Um, don't quite think it's, it's big enough. But, yeah, that beautiful eagle. I think it's eagle. A thrush. Don't know what thrush. This I didn't really realise that there were so many different kinds of thrush. There's a garden thrush, isn't there? And another thrush, but I think there's some more thrushes. I do like thrushes. But I do think, as much as that's quite big, I do think it needs something else. But maybe I could, I was going to say make something else, but you know what I mean. Um, Maybe once it is collaged and stuff. That could be a contender. Right. They lovely, aren't they? But no, a bit too too small. Oh. Oh, they're J's as well, aren't they? The same as. Oh, I like that. It these two now aren't contenders. <laughs> They've just been thrown out of the water. Definite contender. Another thrush. An owl. Oh. <laughs> Such a cute face. And so they've got lovely cute faces. That's beautiful. They're jays as well, aren't they? But are they a different kind of of J? I think they're like a, from a different country, but they're still a J. I don't know if anybody does know, but I know we don't get those. But they are very size wise in this bit and that. It does look like they're from the same same kind of family, so they're not big enough. They're dramatic, aren't they? I think it's going to be those. Those in the bush, I do like those. Oh, they're black bears. I was trying to take them, take them apart. <laughs> oh, big owl. Oh, he's lovely. Definite contender. The, the, the only thing uh, they would win... <laughs> over is they've just got that bit of blue um but he's fabulous on there he knows some stuff doesn't he you can tell that he's a, a wise old owl they're all knowing that's pretty too small yeah beautiful I did mean to use these when I did the woodland uh, series. I just didn't get get round to it. See, that's nice, and it's got the the blue. Now, I just this 
colour goes wonderful. So when I collage, I'm I'm going that side. <laughs> Don't go that side, please. If I do do that, shout, shout out. Right, I think. I don't think there's going to be anything as big, which is... Oh, beautiful. Colours are going to be beautiful with that. Oh, sorry, bird. I put his leg off. Oh, that's nice. They're a type of finch as well, aren't they? I forgot what. Are they both finches? That's very nice as well. So I'm going with that one. That sticker I'm going to put in the in the other folder. Right. Yeah, I like that. It is a little bit too small, but um, I do I do like it, and I think because as well. These have got greenery on. I think it, it, it flows nice. Okay. Um, I just wanted to finish my uh, tea. So I think I'm going to collage this in a different way. I'm going to, instead of build round, I'm going to build from the back of this. Um, I do this a lot when I'm collaging for um, clusters. So, because I don't really want it all, you know, that kind of way and that that in in the middle. I want to start off with this uh, blue paper. So, I'm just cut round there. Okay. Okay, metal. Yeah, I like that. Okay. <clears throat> so I'm going to ink these two pieces up and stick these together because I'm quite happy with with those. Don't know what I'm going to do next. I don't know if I'm going to come down a little bit or go to the side um, a little bit. But I'm thinking if these are stuck down, I can see where I'm going from from that so that's going oh it's that the wrong way because that words yeah it is the wrong way but <laughs> so the musical things don't always go the other way or oh. Is the writing the wrong way? No, the writing's not going to be upset. You know what? I'm going with this side. No, because I like that side better. Yeah, it, of course it's the right way because the clefts are um, the right way. Right, so we're doing it about from there. Oh, I don't think I need any that side. I think that's going to hang over, isn't it? <coughs> right, is that the right? No, it's not. It's a good job I checked, isn't it? I'm going that way. Okay. So, this is going... Is it going like that? Let's have a look for it. Come on, birds. I think that's a little bit too high. Yeah, 
Rebels fab. Oh, I do like that. Right, so that's going like that. Now do we want some music paper coming out here? I don't know. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> I just don't know. Um, <clears throat> no, I'm not. I'm not. I heard you. She's going over there. Right. I don't know if. gonna want yeah just like that it's hard better yeah just like that not like that just like that it was that Tommy Cooper oh gosh that's many, many moons ago. Wow. Yeah. Gosh, my granddad used to love Tommy Cooper. He used to wear that funny hat, didn't he? That was it red with um like a black tassel coming down. I can't even remember any of his gags. Like I don't know what. I'm gonna say comedians in the in the 70s they're totally <laughs> totally different to to now and say so it was a big fan of Markham and Wise they was a lovely pair on the Markham and Wise and saying so, they they carried on for years and years yes I like that I just feel like I'd like that to go in a little bit more. Now you've made it wonky, Tanya. Right, I'm just going to rip up here a little bit. I just don't want that bit sticking out. I don't know why. But I just don't. It's <coughs> just look look like there's no no rhyme or reason is there it's just <laughs> it's just what you find uh visually appealing so yeah i'm liking that so i'm just going to um dab, dab these birds sorry if the camera's shaking i don't think it is but sorry if it is Right, I know there's not much ink on it now, so I, I dare rub across it. I don't, I don't like just rubbing straight across it because if there's too much ink on it, then you've obviously got that blob. Um, I've done that many a time. So I'm just going to see if I can ink around it a little bit. Because I think it, it'll just define it. And I think on something like this, I just think it makes the image like pop, <laughs> pop. Uh, yeah, it just makes it stand stand out a little bit. So that's that. Yeah, I'm liking that. So I just don't know where to go from here. <laughs> this is it. That's it. I've done. Um, definitely doesn't need any more blue. Um, it's it's blue, blue enough. Uh, don't need any more music paper so I'll just pop that to the side are we wanting some of this <coughs> like down the edge I quite like that if I could get some of this um, writing in so I'm going to rip it from the start of the writing and just take that top off let's just get it on my mat a little bit better okay so I don't know what 
I don't know if I'm thinking of going across or if I'm just thinking of kind of going um, like that. So, and it looks lovely on that. <laughs> um, yeah, obviously I don't want any of these birds in. So, let's start with that actually. So if I just take these off. Yep. So I'll save save that. Might might want that for something. Just take this off. Oh, oops. Oh, that's ripped the eel. I don't think I'll be using that anyway. I'm not gonna be going as far as as far as that. Um it just now I know what what papers available because I didn't want any of those birds in. Um, I can see now um, what I can play with. And I'm, I'm kind of thinking to it like this. So let's try let's kind of try this like so once that's inked on oh, i think this needs inking a little bit i don't know why all of a sudden putting that behind oh mind you that softens it again i can say it looked too bright but then that kind of softens it i think there might be too much So that would come to about there. Or do we want to keep the... Right, let's, let's go down. Like so. Yes, I like that. So I'm going to ink ink that up. I am. I'm actually, I don't know why, but I'm going to glue stick this down. And obviously I am cutting, um, cutting, I'm sewing. I'm going to sew around the edges of it. So, so, so. <laughs> um, yeah. It will be. Okay. So come to the top. I'm going to dry glue there. bit off. Let me just bring it a little bit closer. I can't see the see the top. Whoops. Whoops, Jace. Yeah, I think when you do the big pieces with the glue stick, obviously you can just then, if you've not laid it straight, you can just pull it all, all off. Um, whereas, obviously, the art glitter, sometimes you can't take it off because it's stuck straight away. Or if you do take it off, you can then rip underneath your paper. Um, and if you wanted to reposition your other paper somewhere else, um, you might have... You know, I might have torn there and I wanted to move it that way. And, and then you're stuffed because you've obviously got to then cover cover the tear. So I do like using uh, the glue stick for those kinds of things. So anyway, that's enough, enough about glue stick. <laughs> right, I'm just going to do some dobbing. 
bit like, <laughs> it's a bit like dabbing, but it's dabbing. <laughs> Nobody dabs now, do they? I'm sure they don't. If I said that to my daughter, she would absolutely... Uh, her eyes would just roll to the back of her head and she'd probably make some groaning noise. Ugh. <laughs> right, yeah, love that. I mean, really, that, that could be... That could be it. It really could. But I don't know if I want it to be it or not. We'll see. So that's that. So I don't want that. Let's just rip that bit off. That can go in my scraps. What else have we got? We've got some book page. Do we want something like that just running across the top? I don't know. I don't know. We shall, we shall have a look. I think sometimes until you've tried a few things, you don't know if... Sometimes you know that that's it. Like, you don't need anything else. But sometimes you have to try a few things. And then it's like, no, no, I don't actually need anything anything else. So we will try this. I don't think I'd want it showing <coughs> at the bottom as well. I think I would just want it at the top. Yeah, I do like that. Yes, I do like that. So I'm going to ink just around this top part. So, so thin, this dictionary. Um, paper it is lovely but it, it's just so thin to get hold of and uh, ink I like in that side better oh yeah because actually it says African birds let's do that let's do that instead right how long have I been going for let's, let's get a move on right yeah, it's going to go something like that. So what I'm going to do is just put a line of glue across there. And then I'm going to get it. Just yeah, happy with that. So I'll just lift, lift that up. And stick that down. So that's that. That's that. I think I'm happy with that, to be honest. So I'm trying to get all around this. There's a lot of ins and outs and bits and bobs. Looks like the sun's come out now. It's proper like April shower weather. Okay. Yes, I like that. Okay, so I'm going to go 
around the perimeter like that yep. now I did have two two pieces of lace what I said oh I'll save that for my clusters and I remember picking them up yesterday to put them in the tin um, where I put you know just bits um, and I don't know if I did it or not because I'm thinking one of the pieces would have been big enough for um, just a little tab but then again I'm not sure if it needs if it needs one shall I go down a little bit let me just lift lift that up let's have a look Yep, that's fine. So I'll just go around the edges. I keep catching something here. That's it. So I think that's all, all connected. I think maybe something, a word, a label, something. I think we've definitely done with the, the collage. Um, <coughs> so I'll just put my lid on a tick. I'm going to pause because we're getting nearly to an hour. Um, I'm just going to have a route round and then I shall come back. Okay, yeah, <coughs> I had to put that in the thingy. So I'll see if we, we want that or not. So I've got some of the labels out from um, Nanine's uh, Botanical Specimen Care. So I'll have a look. Hmm, possible. Quite like in the, the shape of, of those. Okay, we've got some possibles. I just I thought I'd got that leaf, or was that a different one? Right, so if I had that there, and that there, it's two opposites on top. I quite like that. If I use that, it would have to be at the bottom. I like that too. So I don't think any of these two blank ones go. No. <clears throat> so 
we're left with this. So do we want two ovals? Do we want it? I'm kind of going for this one. Um, so do we want it like so? Definitely don't want it like that. No, I think I'm feeling this more, <coughs> more up here. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, and I think it's kind of got to go like that. Looks funny like that. Right, let's let's ink ink that. Just getting where where I've cut it to get rid of the the white, the core of the paper. So these are nice and nice and grungy anyway. So let me just bring that to me a little bit. Yeah, I like that. So that's that. That's not straight. Yeah. And then I like it there, but it's just not. My eyes not liking it there. Yeah, I think it needs to go half. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Okay. Now, I don't know if I do want another kind of piece of paper here. Um, but then I think, but we have got that and it is decoration. So, I haven't inked around it, have I? That's, um, ink around it. Shoulder ache. Right. I don't know if this is going to be um, thick enough, really, wide enough. Obviously, it's far too big. Let's let's just pretend. <laughs> let's um, see what that would look like. So yeah, I think I'll sew that onto there, but I'll sew it as I sew sew around it. So. We'll call it a day for today. I don't think we've done too bad. Um, so that's those done. Um, just thinking where we'll be the next time we come back. Let's put that lid on. I don't want to get ink on it. So that's going to live in there. Oh, that's lovely. So, do I want a tab? Or do I want one at the top? I think I'm going to do one at the top. 
yeah, I'm going to do one at the top. So it would be... Like so. Yeah. So yeah, I really like that. Might just ink that down just a little bit more. Um, it's got the tags in here. There's my scissors. Cut these down a little bit. Like so. Yeah, I like that. And... that one in that I don't know why the after March but the day yeah and then that one in there so yeah that's lovely so thank you very much for joining me like I say, I'll get that sewed round, I'll get that on and we shall think where we're at the next time. So, bye for now. Thanks for joining me.